In this video, we're going to be sketching y equals x plus 5 over x squared take away 3x plus 2. OK, so first thing to do, see if you can factorise, well, in this case, the denominator, x plus 5 can stay as it is. And so we're going to get x take away 2, x take away 1. OK. Right, vertical asymptotes first then, so that's when the denominator is 0, so that'd be at 1 and 2. So x equals 1 and x equals 2. OK. Right, and where is it crossing the x-axis? That's when the numerator is 0, so that's what minus 5. And where is it crossing the y-axis? Well, that's when x is 0, and so that will be 5 over 2. So 5 halves, somewhere there. And how about a horizontal asymptote? Well, uh, the horizontal asymptote in this case, uh, because you've got the numerator is of a lower order than the denominator, that means that the horizontal asymptote will be y equals 0. You can show this by dividing top model by x squared and getting 1 over x plus 5 over x squared over 1 take away 3 over x plus 2 over x squared. And clearly, this is going to tend to 0 as x tends to positive or negative infinity. So that means that y equals 0 is a horizontal asymptote. Right, OK. Um, so I don't need to check to see whether the curve's going to cross the horizontal asymptote again because that would be where it's crossing the x-axis and I know there's only one point where it crosses the x-axis and minus 5. So what must the curve be doing? Well, it's got to be tending towards this asymptote and then coming down through 5 halves. We're going to have to go through minus 5 on the x-axis and then come back on ourselves in order to tend towards that line. OK? So we've got to come down and then back on ourselves. So it's going to be that hump. OK? It's a pro pretty shoddy looking curve. <laughs> oh, it'll, it'll do. Um, right. How about over here then? Well, it's a bit of a mystery, isn't it? Right? Um, there's no kind of like uh, things that we can um, really work with there. So. How about we start substituting some values in? So let's try x equals 1.5, see if it's positive or negative. So in the numerator, we've got uh, 1.5 plus 5, so that's positive. In the denominator, 1.5 take away 2 is negative. 1.5 take away 1 is positive. So we've got positive over negative, which is negative. So that means we are down here for that part of the graph. I'm going to be a little bit careful. Like that, OK? Right, now I'm going to check uh, like x is 3 and see what we get. So in the top uh, numerator, we get positive. 3 plus 5 is positive. 3 take away 2 is positive. 3 take away 1 is positive. And so positive over positive. And so it must be up here. OK? And so that is what the curve y equals x plus 5 over x squared take away 3x plus 2 must look like.